Good morning everyone. We're going to have a little art challenge this morning, so have a little look. We're going to use our, some paper and some paints. So, I'm going to fold my paper in half. So, corner to corner, edge to edge, and push it in. That's it folded in half. I'm going to fold it again, corner to corner, edge to edge. Try and match it up. There we go. Right, if you want to leave it at four, four bits, you can do that. Or if you want to make it extra tricky, we can fold it again, corner to corner edge to edge. Right, so your challenge, when I open it up, I've got eight different parts of the paper. I'm just going to draw a line on it so you can see. Um, okay, there we are. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight different parts of the paper. So your challenge for today is to see if you can make every bit of the paper a different pattern. So you might want to use different colours, you might want to use different shapes, um, but to make it as bright and colourful and different as possible. So let's show you some examples. So on first one, I might do some spots or dots, so just a few circles, different sizes. And then I would colour some of those in, maybe have some nice red spots. Okay, and I'd colour in the background as well. On the next one, it needs to be different. So let's see, this time I might have some stripes. Again, I'll choose some colours, I'm going to colour it in. I'm just doing this quickly to show you. Um, but you can take your time and make it beautiful. So try and stay inside the lines you've drawn for yourself if you can. So I would use lots of different colours. I might want to make a pattern with two colours. So I think on this one I'm going to have orange, blue, orange. Very quickly just to show you. Blue. And carry on like that, making a pattern. And the next one, I want it to be different again. I could maybe have another lot of stripes, but just going the other way. I could maybe have stripes going up and down the way. Or you could have zigzags in another one. See, this shows you you need two hands. <laughs> I'm trying to hold the camera with one. You need two hands to hold it nice and still. Uh, we could have maybe swirls. We could have lots of just funny patterns and shapes. Squiggles. That you can then colour in the different bits. And you can again use different colours to colour in all the different parts. So you can see what I'm doing. Every single bit is different. 
have a go. I would love to see your um, finished art, finished work, artwork, and you can post it onto the e journals to let us all see. Good luck and see how many different patterns you can make. Bye.